So just started his apprenticeship, I think he was two years in or so. Um, just a routine job come in and what I know of is wasn't decompressed, the cylinder wasn't decompressed or something. He's come in, there's no tags or anything on it. Just routine job, started pulling bolts out. And um, yeah, just got to the last few and she just let go. And just, yeah, took him out. I was actually on my way to school. I actually heard about it on the radio when I was sitting in the car. Didn't, there was no names at that time, but as I was going on the bus, it was a bit caught. And I sat down next to my one of my mates and he was a bit upset. And he said, oh, Josh died. I said, oh, ah, you can't be for real. And then, yeah, and then he just said, just suddenly sunk in and you just think, oh, how could that happen? His mum's boyfriend come down and told me, and I told him, I thought he was joking, and that, and he goes, no, I'm serious. So I was just sitting there, just looking out the window, thinking, you know, why Josh? Knocked me around a bit, because um, I knew him for pretty much all my life. A bit stunned at first, I couldn't believe that it actually happened. Like, Didn't really know how to handle it. Um, someone so close to you, so young, um, you know, just tried to get on, tried, I guess, to cover it up, act normal and that, but, you know, Subconsciously, you're still thinking of it. Yeah, it was just, it was a big shock, like, just going to work one morning, got the call from my um, old boy. Yeah, he's been, been killed at work and whatever, and, yeah, no, it's just, just rocks your world, eh? You don't know what to think. Do anything for his mates, really, if you ask him. Preschool, pretty well to grade 10 when Josh left, I was in nearly everyone, well, not everyone, but in a class each year type of thing, so, you know, then on the bus on the way home and stuff, so you get to know him pretty well. Yeah, known him since start, we started school. We all started school together, same place, and yeah, so yeah, I've known him a long time. Yeah, go and follow, just love these cars, like do anything what he was feeling, just good fellow to hang around with. Always there to help you out, help a mate out and that. I, I just thought it was a big shock to be just having as one of your mates, you think you hear it happen on everyone else and you think, oh, must have been doing something wrong, but when it's one of your mates, it's a lot different. It takes it in, hey, it takes it out of you. Makes you step back and think a bit about what you're doing and that. Like you can just it can just happen to anyone. I'm doing the same thing that or similar thing to what Josh was doing. Yeah, it really makes you think, like you just gotta make sure you're always looking out for yourself and and your teammates and that. Just make sure nothing's gonna go wrong. Just check and double check. If you don't know, you just got to ask someone. <laughs>